Hello, my name is Gray Martin. I am a dragon fruit grower in the San Diego area of California. And Antonio requested that I speak to you regarding the variety problem, issue, situation regarding the dragon fruit. The topic of varieties is extremely complex. There um, are so many components to it. For example, you need to know your market. You need to know your climate conditions. What is beneficial for your situation, your soil, your water, your your uh, proximity to the city or your buyer? So I would like to actually discuss varieties in terms of what I suggest you might do in the beginning. It's very different from what I did 20 years ago. I developed my own varieties, but it took me a period of 10 years. And, well, actually longer, but I, what I'm saying is 20 years ago, I could afford to take 10 years. Now it's, it's somewhat different. So here would be my recommendation. Collect as many different varieties as you can and grow, oh, somewhere in the neighborhood of 15 to 20 of each one. And um, with not too many of each species, so probably uh, two or three Costa Ricensis, three Guatemalensis, two or three Undatas, see if you can find some hybrids, and grow them and take records of the seasonality. In other words, when does the fruit mature and how much fruit in that time period does it mature? And this will give you an idea of the complexity of the different varieties. You can also, or you must also, um, um, test the quality of the dragon fruit, but um, there's so many components to the dragon fruit that are not strictly related to the fruit quality. Now, fruit quality for me is so important for the market, so I had to develop my own varieties. I have very little time in this video, but let me try starting with that.